welcome to the Matchday Vlogs YouTube channel. As always, please remember to smash that like button and hit subscribe because it really does, really does make a difference to the channel. So drop us a like. Uh, right, we're here at the mighty St. Mary Stadium for a Friday night fixture against Aston Villa. It's under the lights. We're feeling... How are we feeling? I'm feeling really confident tonight. Are you? Yeah, I'm feeling really confident. I don't think I don't know if it's actually because it's under the lights and it's going to be a fun night. But I also saw how Villa played last week against West Ham. I know, right? And they got players out. But yeah, actually on the bookies' odds, I think we are actually favourites to win tonight. So we shall see. Right, we have Vlog Dad here as well, and let me tilt this in there. Vlog Dad, do we have a score prediction? I'm actually going to go for 3-1 today. I'm feeling slightly oh. confident. That's the same as me, you know that. No, I didn't. Yeah, yeah I went for 3-1, yeah. Oh, all yeah, yeah. oh, right. Well, that, that was no conferring. There we go. So we got a 3-1, a 3-1, and a 2-0. Jack's already on the Instagram. <laughs> Fantastic. Right, the famous words. Let's do this.
Right, it is half time here at St Mary Stadium. It's currently Southampton 1, Aston Villa 0. Oh my goodness. I'm in absolute awe. That first five, ten minutes was insane. Villa have done nothing. I mean, they tactically set up completely wrong, I think. But let's not take away anything from our performance. But I think we've been absolutely stunning. And what a goal from Adam Armstrong, eh? Oh, mate, that's like... We've been, we've been privileged to some fun goals so far this season. But that might be the best one so far. I'm going to be watching that a lot this week, I think. <laughs> I, think I enjoyed that. Oh, yeah. The, Adam Armstrong has had probably that, the, the half of his career so far with Southampton. He was so good. He's like The pace of him, the aggression, the press has been fantastic. And the fact he got it in with the first shot. Woo! Super happy. We kind of think that Villa might come out in the second half a bit of a different setup. I just don't think their formation is working for them. And their passing play is dreadful. But we seem to be playing a bit risky at the back. But we still seem to be playing one-touch football and it's looking really good. There's plenty of opportunities. Just a shame we can't score more goals at the moment. But we shall see second half coming up. stoppage time here there is seven minutes to be played though this is going to be a long seven minutes Aston Villa have definitely shown up in the second half we need to get on the break and score a second that's what we need to do that's a good pass that's it keep going it's Diallo that ball what's your clock say Jack that's two minutes draw the foul draw the foul Seriously, Timo, Timo, what have you done? He was off, he was offside. Here we go! Dagorana! Three minutes. The Villa fans are pouring out now. I think they've given up. I wouldn't know. To be fair to Villa, they have shown up in the second half. I don't know who we were playing in the first half, but Villa have definitely shown up in the, se in the second half. That's the last time I've done seven minutes of stop and shove again. Oh my word. Jack, what do you make of that? Definitely a different Aston Villa showed up in the second half. Uh, it, we were forced into making some substitutions, putting us in more of the defensive mode, inviting Villa onto us, but my goodness, holding out like that. Uh, I'm in bits. Anything? Mate, that was the most stressful 45 minutes. That clock never seemed to move that entire second half. You're right. Villa came out second half. If they had, if they did, probably, if they did have Ings, it probably would have been a different story this game. They had no threat going forward. You know, they had plenty of set pieces, plenty of chances, but in reality, they didn't do anything with it. The boys are done us proud today. They've been so good. So proud. We're going to soak up some of this atmosphere. Have a wonderful weekend because what a start to a. We go into the international break in a very decent position. Ah, oh, happy days. You now have to come to every game now that you've seen a win. Yes. You're a lucky child. Yeah. We win and we get a clean sheet. Yeah, absolutely. You're buying that seat for the season. <laughs> All right, like, comment, share, subscribe. We'll see you in the next one. All right, see ya. Oh, 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 oh,